Hi. Number one pet peeve that I have with Mindy, she is one messy creature. <sighs> The first one I have down is your temper tantrum over electronics when they're not working. But the nice part about it is having her being so much younger, and I hand it to her and within <laughs> like 30 seconds it's <laughs> fixed. Number two, she likes to complain. It's too hot in Florida. And you leave piles of stuff in the house. I don't have anywhere to put any of that junk. Bye! Bye. Well, we're here with 27-year-old Mindy and her 58-year-old husband, Larry. Now, they insist that their 30-year age difference doesn't cause any problems in their marriage, I mean, between the two of them, but not everyone is supportive. Now, you had to know that this would be controversial, which is why you didn't introduce him exactly. to everybody the day the relationship started, the reason you didn't put him on camera, uh, right from the beginning. So you had concerns about it. I did, because we're different. And so you you can't be surprised when you got a reaction. Exactly. Right? Not surprised, just a little concerned. I expect a certain amount of hate. I think that anybody that puts themselves out there is going to receive it. Right. However, when somebody sends items to your home and is scary and threatening beyond belief, that's a little... Where do you draw the line with that? Right. Or how do you cope my, with it? My initial response to the hate that, that was being generated on comments was, it doesn't bother me. Uh, and, I, and I've tried to tell her, if it's a family member, someone close, someone that you've invested a lot in emotions and time with, and they say something negative towards you, I can understand being hurt. But these people we've never met, we don't know them, we'll probably never see them. We don't get a chance to know them. Mm -hmm. So as far as whatever they have to say about me, I could care less. Yeah. And <laughs> You have two categories here. One are haters, these keyboard bullies. Mm -hmm. And there are, these, these are the people that say things to you that they would never say to you in an elevator. <laughs> Thank goodness. They would never <laughs> say it to you if they were standing behind you in the line at the grocery store. But they'll say it with the anonymity of a keyboard. Then there's the other category of when they jump from cyber world to the real world. And if somebody shows up in your driveway or shows up outside, that's a whole different kettle of fish there, and I, I understand that. But look, you decided to go public. Right. And put yourself in the public arena. But it's not for everybody. Right. You're either tough enough to deal with that or you're not. I'm one of those people that has always said, I don't have a need to be loved by strangers. Why do they watch the whole video and then do something like that? If I see something I don't like, I don't spend well, my time watching it. Because some people love to hate. That's this guy, and his main goal was that I should stop making videos. And I said to him on the phone, I said, I will never stop making videos because I want to help others. Okay, and let me, let me give you some advice. That's a mistake. Oh, no. You don't ever want to engage with a hater, ever, never, ever, never, yeah. because it gives them power. I'm glad you said that, because sometimes I don't know if I should respond or not. Should never, ever engage with a hater. I've testified before Congress about cyberbullying and worked on curriculums to use in schools and stuff. You don't want to engage with them. That's exactly what they want. Block, report, and flag content. Realize that bullies are simply trying to get a reaction. Don't let them have control by overreacting and just stay calm. And realize it comes with the territory. You chose to put it out there. Just realize that that comes with the territory. If this was easy, everybody would do it. And you have a very successful channel, so. Thank you. You know, it's hard work, so realize that's just part of the problem, right? You just have to deal with that. Got to deal with it and block yeah. the haters. Don't respond. And it the just... more successful you are, the more haters you will have. Absolutely.